All right, so this is Tony from Food and Beverage here on the Disney Magic. What exactly does that entail? Are you a taste tester? Because that would be the greatest job ever. Yeah, well, every morning. Generally, uh, breakfast is my favorite meal, oh. as you can tell. <laughs> no, um, I uh, sort of run the whole food and beverage for Disney Cruise Line. Okay. Um, we put together, I have a team of people who put together all the menus, all the beverage menus, look after all the service in the dining room, everything food and beverage related that I'm in charge of, all the priorities of getting all the product on the ship, so I'm in charge of all the hotel stores as well that comes on the ship, all the food product, all the alcohol product, everything. Well, okay, so, so let's not get busy. into the alcohol just now because it is a family show, but that's been quite amazing. Some really interesting drinks on board. Um, and, you know, this is still the beginning of the week, so I haven't had a chance to taste as much as I'm looking forward to tasting. But I've noticed a considerable difference in the quality of food, not necessarily just within the Disney Cruise Line, but I've cruised other ships. Okay. And on Disney, it's a, it, like you're doing a bang-up job, Tony. I try. Well, it's not only me, obviously. I have nearly 3,000 people who report to me, so obviously they are doing the job, not me. But uh, I have a great team of people who do it for me. You know, and to do it for Disney Cruise Line rather than me, I would think. But um, we've tried our best to sort of elevate our game over the years. So we're getting better and better as uh, as time goes on, which is yeah. great. So it's yeah. always a good thing. It is really impressive. And, you know, you're not taking much of the credit because you have this amazing staff that works for you. But um, before Tony sat down, he asked if we could talk about the Eagles. And I said, not today because <laughs> we're still reeling from that Giants loss which was a giant loss, by the way. Yeah. But, um, but you know, I, I mean, obviously, a sports fan, you know that it all starts with the coach. That they get the glory or they get the blame. So in this yeah. situation, you're getting the glory, my friend. Yeah, I get a lot of blame as well. So <laughs> it's not too bad. Food and beverage, you can't please everyone. You know, I yeah. learned that many, many years ago, you know, because everybody has a mother who can cook better than anybody else's mother. <laughs> so I think you just have to take the criticism with the glory. So, you know, it's as long as you're big enough and have big enough shoulders to take both, you're generally in pretty good shape. What is your favorite meal here on the ship? What is the one thing that I have to have before I leave? Probably. I'm sure you'll be going to Palo sometime during the Tonight? cruise. Tonight? So I would think uh, if you have to have something, I'm from Wales, so lamb is my favorite uh, choice of okay. meat, protein. Mm -hmm. And then obviously you have to have the chocolate souffle, I would think, in okay. uh, Palo. Yeah, I think... Probably any time someone offers you a chocolate souffle, you have to go for it. Yeah, but it's pretty special up there, so yeah, I okay. hope you enjoy it. I look forward to yeah, it. Tony, good. it's been a pleasure. Great, no problem. Thank you. Anytime.